So let's start with the HVZ reaction, which is very important reaction of carboxylic acid. Let's see the mechanism and the application of HVZ. So in the presence of phosphorus, aliphatic carboxylic acid reacts smoothly with the chlorine or bromine to yield alpha hydrogen is replaced by halogen. See, this is carboxylic acid and in HVZ reaction, you will get alpha substituted halogen this is a continuation reaction but if you do control one halogen will be replaced at the alpha so any carboxylic acid if you require alpha position any halogen bromine you will treat this molecule with pbr3 and one bromine will attack to alpha position so this will be the final product so let's see what is the mechanism of uh, hvz reaction HVZ reaction. In HVZ reaction, we uh, treat phosphorus with bromine or any other halogen like chlorine in which phosphorus is a limiting reagent and phosphorus and bromine at first give you PBr3. Now let us take an example of CH3 C double bond OOH. This is acetic acid and the acetic acid when treated with PBr3 you know the reaction it will give you CH3COPR now we know that it consists of a small amount of enolic content also so this will be the enol form of this molecule in the enol form the bromine attack with the same method as in hydrocarbon chapter you have already read this side the formation of cyclic compound with the formation of cyclic compound the plus r effect replace this bromine that means at alpha position cobr when treated with acidic water this cocl is now converted to cooh so you will get alpha bromo carboxylic acid which is very useful now let us see what are the use of this reaction if you treat this liquid ammonia you will get alpha amino acid this bromine will easily replaced by any nucleophile with the OH minus you will get Cl replaced by OH with Grignard reagent if you take RMGBR this Cl will be replaced by R so you can able to easily replace the alkyl group with any nucleophile which you want to add at the alpha position of COOH group now let's take one question of HVZ consider the following reaction so what will be the value of x to get this and what will be the value of y to get ammonia so all of you know that cooh alpha position bromine that means hvz so x must be bromine in presence of p4 and this is liquid ammonia you must add so that bromine is replaced by ammonia so the correct option is c at first hvz then ammonia is substituted so i hope all of you have understood hvz reaction do solve questions and watch my next video for next name reaction thank